guys, in this video, I will show you how you can fix Valorant store not loading. So uh, the first thing what you need to do here, you need to run a Riot Games client here. And then on the top right corner, you should uh, log out, sign out from your account. And after that, try to log into your account and you need to look if the problem persists or not. And if the problem persists, then completely close uh, right client. And another thing that you can do here, you can um, basically change your DNS server address. And to do so, you need to, on the bottom right corner, you should see system tray. And here you should see your network icon, icon here. So you need to right click on it, go to network and internet settings. Uh, you need to go to advanced in, uh, network settings here. And then you need to go to more adapter options. And here you'll find your uh, network connection, uh, right click on it, go to properties. And first thing what you need to do here, you need to make sure that internet protocol version four, uh, version six is disabled. And if it is, then you need to go to internet protocol version uh, four. And then you need to basically press this button that says use the following DNS server addresses and on preferred DNS server you just need to write 8.8.8.8 and on alternate DNS server you just need to write 8.8.4.4 apply changes you start your computer and you need to look if the problem persists or not and if the problem persists uh, another thing that you can do here you can clear your DNS cache so to do so you just need to open up your command prompt so on search you just need to write cmd and then run this program as administrator I press yes and on this command prompt uh, basically window we need to uh, enter uh, these commands uh, one by one so ip uh, config renew uh, basically put it here press enter then ip config flash dns and uh, nash int ip v4 reset then nash int ip v6 reset nash uh, uh, win http reset proxy and ip config slash register dns so basically put all these commands uh, one by one and then you start the computer and you need to look if the problem persists or not and if the problem persists, another thing that you can do here, you can clear your Riot client cache. And to do so, you just need to completely close your Riot client. First of all, open up Task Manager, and it should be no uh, Riot client tasks here. And if it is, please end them just by pressing on the task, right click on it and press end task. And uh, when there is no right client uh, tasks running on your computer, you just need to unsearch uh, right run or just press Windows Anaki. And on this window, you just need to write percentage uh, sign, app data percentage sign, press OK. And then you need to go to app data, local, and then you need to just write, uh, basically find right games folder here and delete uh, right client here, right? And then you just need to log into uh, your right client and you need to look if the problem persists or not. And if the problem persists, another basically thing that you can do here, if you're running third party antivirus programs like Avast, McAfee or Kaspersky or, or, or others, uh, please disable them. And then you just need to try to log into your right client and you need to look if the problem persists or not. But if you apply all these changes, you should fix your problem, right? So that's pretty much it. And if I help you out, please press like button and subscribe for more. Take care. Bye.